All right, the highlights from GreatStockPicks.com, live trading chat room on June 24th, ISIS, if you traded today, uh, half million shares right there in the first five minutes, nice gap up, had good news um, about one of their drugs, I believe. So you had a high, you had a lower high here, and uh, you know, sellers always try to take these down, shorts come in, and if they can't, you've got a powerful move to the upside. So I called it just long over 25.50, and I said, guys, I'd love to give you a tight stop, but the worst place, I mean, the, the logical stop is at 25. So 50 cents risk is more than I usually call, but anyway, um, it was coming up here, and you can see why I put the stop below 25. If it takes out if it takes out 25.50 to the upside and then takes out this candle to the downside, you're probably wrong, right? Um, anyway, so there you get the high of day, and it really didn't look back. Um, this was a really nice one. I also made a video today about a, a secondary possible entry right around this green line here. That's a really nice turn right there, and it made perfect sense. So if you get time, um, that's in a separate video. I won't go into it here. But anyway, um, entry idea on ISIS um, was 25.51, and it went to 25.84. So that's slightly over a three dollar move on 50 cents risk so that that makes the 50 cents uh you know not seem so bad anymore um ebix if you watched our video last night i had this on watch um thought it was overdue for a bounce there's the opening five minute candle i don't generally call stuff this early but there's the opening five minute candle um it was narrow enough and you had this nice pop as i talked about in the video last night and this night nice pop friday afternoon that my thinking was if it breaks this five minute candles high, stop below the five minute candles low. That's pretty good risk reward. So um, 950 with a 929 stop. And uh, within five minutes, within no, within about 10 minutes, it was at 10. So a quick 50 cent move. Um, easy money on that one this morning. Coach, I also mentioned here as a possible long over this candle right here. Um, over this candle with the bottoming tail. I just called it as a fives play, um, which would have been 54, 86, 54, 65. And over the next 10 minutes, it went to 55, uh, 32. Not a bad little trade there if anyone took it. Um, and the reason for the call, it gapped down and then was hitting the 200 day. Um, and you can see it ended up after that secondary wave down, it ended up all the way back up there. And it was a, it was kind of a weird day and I wasn't too anxious to trade this morning, but we had some nice ones. Um, H-A-L-O, one of our members mentioned uh, the volume spike here. I like to switch to two minute candles and see if I can play that first pullback. Um, now I didn't call this one over the mic. I just said, hey, Halo uh, setting up on twos. I typed it out in the chat, um, which would have made the entry 643 with a 634 stop. In other words, first break of a previous two minute candles high following the volume pop. And um, you know what, from 643, that thing went all the way to, uh, to 688, which is a huge percentage gain in a very short period of time. Um, but to be fair, I don't know that anyone took it because, like I said, I didn't get on the mic. I just typed it out in the chat room. Um, Osmond K., one of our all-stars, called CarMax this morning. Um, he had to gab down, and then when it started to come back up, CarMax was, I think, deemed by a lot of us overdone on Friday. So uh, his thinking was high of day break here uh, over 44. He stopped it at 43.70, and boom, 44, and within five minutes at 44.60. So anytime you get a 60-cent move in five minutes, um, early on in the day that's you know pay yourself along the way that was a nice call by uh by osmond k as well and um that's all i've got guys uh i'll, I'll quit babbling and we'll see you guys tomorrow